This model is a promotional item made for MAN trucks by Conrad. It comes in a standard Conrad branded box with just a label at the end that describes what's inside. Well actually it describes the model inside and not the packaging which is foam rubber on a cardboard backing. And because it's soft it protects the model well during shipping. Sadly there's no information about either the real truck or the model. And inside the packaging there's a curtain side trailer, an MAN tractor and a bag of small parts. As usual you have to separate some parts but don't worry if you've got a blunt knife because you can use blunt fingers instead and pull the pieces apart. If you get some untidy mouldings as a result you can always trim those up separately. Once the parts are separated they can be fitted and we'll start with the door mirrors. It's time for a viewer question and this one is from Frieda Liffery of Switzerland. Frieda asks, is it okay to use the boxes that models come in to store second hand omelettes? Well Frieda, the only answer I think I can give is that you keep taking the medicine you're given and let's hope for some improvement. Back to the review and as it's an MAN truck there's a little bit of pre-assembly to do on the mirror on the passenger side. And then that can just be pressed into place easily. It's also possible to adjust the little extra mirror at the front to get it at the right angle. The only other assembly is to fit the roof aerials and they're best gripped close to the base and then pushed into the holes. The chassis is quite good, it's got the rear suspension and drive shaft modelled and the gearbox can be seen too. At the front the steering is purely modelled for functionality. The tyre tread pattern is the same front and rear with the front tyres being a bit fatter and the wheels are nice and smart. The cab has got a nice metallic type paint with colour coded door mirrors and there's a Euro 6 badge on the side to indicate that the truck meets the Euro 6 exhaust gas standard. Behind the cab there are walkways and nicely rendered fuel tanks and the wheel arches are appropriately plastic. There are no number plates because this is a generic promotional model but the lights have nice plastic lenses. Looking underneath the trailer a number of the parts are plastic including the landing legs at the front and there are tough plastic mud flaps at the rear. But the rest of the trailer body is metal and it's actually quite heavy. There's no detail at the front and the curtain side tie downs are represented by graphics. Although the metal body side has no texture to represent curtains the graphics are very good. At the rear the doors have bolts and hinges highlighted in the casting and the rear lights are painted. So let's take the MAN out onto the Cranes Etc Autobahn and we see that it's smooth without being free rolling. The wheels all turn independently and there's float on the rear axle to represent suspension. And one thing that's always very good on Conrad models is the steering and this one has a very large range of movement. So with the wheel set it poses well and takes a sharp turn to the left. The other feature on the MAN tractor is the tilting cab. But on this version of the model the tilt was fairly restricted so you couldn't put the cab fully forward. But at least you can get a peek at the engine. Moving on to the trailer and it rolls well enough. And on picking it up it's interesting to see that again each of the wheels rolls separately. Another feature on the wheels is that there is working suspension. The rear two axles are fully sprung and they work well. But the first axle has a constraint in place so it's got very limited movement. Towards the front there are a pair of plastic landing legs and these have simple pull down pads which are held in place by friction. But they work well enough and hold the trailer level. With the tractor and trailer all set then we can join them up. And it's an easy task with the kingpin of the trailer slotting into the fifth wheel of the tractor. A final push and click and they're securely linked together and then you can drive them away. There is one other feature on the trailer which is quite unusual for a box trailer like this and it has opening rear doors which is quite nice. And with the doors open just imagine all the things you can hide away inside this model. In fact you can have fun with the whole family by putting the TV remote control inside, shutting the doors so no one will ever find it. Here at Cranes Etc we also use the box trailer as a sin bin when Cranes Etc team members use foul language. This truck model by Conrad is heavy, strong and very robust. It also looks good in this special MAN promotional livery. As well as the detail, the functionality is good and with the opening trail doors, it's highly recommended. Yeah.